welcome back to another episode of uh, scholarship alert now we are going to our english friends so if you studied english or you are very close to or interested in studying english anything english then this opportunity is for you today we are going to look at james medicine university english department and they are offering funding for the ma in english this is also a very good school to consider if you are interested in studying languages especially english so i'm going to take you through the scholarship uh, uh, opportunities that they have admission requirements and what you need to get to apply to this school so first of all if you look at uh, the website as i have shared with you i will leave the link in the video description section uh, graduate assistantship offer for funding this is good news so what it means is that in this school when you apply uh, for this program uh, you are offered full funding if you are admitted so for virtually all full-time students all full-time this is important all full-time students the ma in english program is fully funded fully funded students receive funding through a com a, com a combination of graduate assistantship held by the english department and partnership with other offices on camp on campus which provide valuable professional experience that supplement their graduate coursework graduate assistantship graduate assistant receive a full tuition waiver and a stipend for their two years in the program in this multifaceted assistantship structure wow this is a very good school it's a very good opportunity to consider if you are looking for uh, scholarship or if you are looking for yes scholarship in in the english uh, field or masters in english ma in english now let's look at admission requirement that is important to apply applica application are due february uh, one see below and the application deadline for so you have from now up to february one to prepare so this is something you should consider uh, prospective students should visit the graduate school website for information about the application process. Okay, let's look at required material. This is important. You first need transcripts from all undergraduate and graduate programs. So you need your transcript as, as usual. At least two letters of recommendation from faculty familiar with the applicants, academic uh, performances, and potentials for graduate work. Good. So here you need uh, uh, recommendation two. Then you need a substantial academic writing sample. So you need a very strong academic writing sample sample papers like uh, it can be your thesis it can be a project you did it can be a final year exams it can be a paper a long paper you you, you wrote something 10 to 20 pages and i think uh, if if you are really uh, ready for graduate work with this opportunity uh, you must be able to get this uh, very easy and try to uh, look at your past work and see what you can find a statement of purpose you are you are looking at a statement of approximately 500 words that's almost uh, one page uh, a statement of purpose which is simple you uh, a resume is strongly recommended so you have to submit your cv or your resume any additional material that provided a uh, graduate committee with information about application applicant suitability and prepared preparation for graduate studies so any opportunity any application sorry any any document any fact that will support your case importantly the gra test score are optional and not required for admission that is very good so you can look at this school and they are looking for uh, a minimum overall gp of 3.0 which is good and which is cool and the writing sample that demonstrates strong intellectual i have talked about it and the application deadline is as i said february you have up to february one to apply uh, to this school so this is a very good school that you can consider they also have unconditional admission and they have conditional admissions so uh, they also have provisional admissions so whatever it is when you apply you are highly assured of getting admission and getting some funding for yourself thanks again for being here and stay blessed